Hey everyone, my name is Victoria and welcome to my channel. Today's video is all about the iPad for students. I'm going to show you how I create aesthetic digital notes on my iPad and share some of my favorite iPad apps, including digital planning. I also share useful tips for student productivity. I get a lot of questions about how I take notes on my iPad. GoodNotes is a very popular app with tons of features, but as a cheaper alternative, I recommend the Digital Planner app. Right now I'm using a standard template, but like most note-taking apps, it has built-in templates you can use. I mix handwritten and typed text and also use the handwriting to text conversion feature on iPad, which you can enable in the Apple Pencil settings. I love that you can change the color of your notes and it's easy to create a pen of any color by copying and pasting the hex code. I use this free app called Cooler to find different color palettes. You can enhance your notes by adding images from your photo album. In photos, you can long press an image to lift it from the background. Apps like GoodNotes can also record and convert your voice notes into text. With the lasso tool, you can move selected elements as well as copy them to the clipboard and paste them into other notes. You can also annotate lecture slides and worksheets. And if you don't have them in digital form, you can simply scan any document with your camera, which will automatically enhance and clean them up. My channel is all about digital planning, and I use this planner to stay organized, keep track of my to-do list, and even write a digital journal whenever I feel like it. The digital planner is designed with students in mind, featuring a core planner, useful student templates, and the ability to import any other templates or PDF planners. This planner has sections for all key aspects of planning. There's a motivational plan section where you can write down inspiring goals, as well as sections for detailed daily, weekly, monthly, and yearly planning. Each section helps you organize your time effectively and achieve your goals. Apps like GoodNotes can sync between your iPad and iPhone, so you can easily check your planner on the go. Plus, you can sync it with both Apple and Google calendars. The digital planner also allows file sharing for team collaboration. I've made a separate video about the planner where I explained its features in detail and shared tips on how to set it up for maximum productivity. If you want to learn more, you can check out my beginner's guide. I'll include a link to my planner in the video description. Besides note-taking, the iPad has other great apps for students. Study Bunny helps you focus on studying with a timer, earning coins to take care of your virtual bunny pet. Quizlet offers flashcards, quizzes, and games to help you study and memorize information. You can collaborate with others and use a vast library of user-generated content. For reading, I recommend Kindle or Apple Books, which provide access to tons of eBooks and let you customize font size, choose themes, highlight text, and add notes. The built-in dictionary and the ability to create study flashcards from highlighted notes make them especially handy. Libby and Hoopla Digital offer free access to eBooks and audiobooks with a library card, which is great for students looking for free resources, though availability may vary by country. ChatGPT is an AI-powered app that helps with finding answers, generating ideas, and explaining various topics, although you shouldn't rely on it completely. Here's some of my favorite iPad features for students. You can take a screenshot by swiping your Apple Pencil from the bottom left corner and annotate it. You can also save an entire web page by selecting the full page option and then share it to a notes app for future study. QuickNote is activated by swiping the Apple Pencil from the bottom right corner, letting you highlight useful information on a web page and add it to your QuickNotes. When you open the note, the saved information will be highlighted. For multitasking, simply drag and drop apps on the screen to add multiple apps and switch between them. Scribble automatically converts handwritten text into typed text and can be enabled in Apple Pencil settings where you can also customize gestures. I love creating digital notes and planning and with so many apps available, it's become even more convenient. Share your favorite iPad apps and tips for students in the comments. I hope this video was helpful for you. Make sure to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on other videos. Thanks for watching and see you next time.